is he going to fight for a championship? He's rated number one by multiple organizations. He could fight Boo Boo Andrade. He could fight Charlo. You know, Devin Haney, or no, excuse me, not Devin Haney, but every other middleweight would love to fight Mugia because of the attention and the money that he would bring. No, the money, the attention, and look at the crowd. They love him here. But yes, you know what? I'm going to have to. I'm going to have to agree with some people here now. This was Jaime Munguia's 39th fight. Munguia has been in there with tough guys, French contenders, and he's held his own. They moved him prudently, I would say, you know, because they moved him carefully. But now it's time to step up, and I want to see him in with the big dogs as well. That's one thing we can all agree with. When is Munguia going to step up to the plate and stop cherry picking? I mean, he's 39 and 0 about to be 30 years old what is he waiting for he has been andrade mandatory for the past three to four years in that time stamp Mongia turned down three offers to fight andrade for a world title to make matters worse they were his biggest offers till his day therefore the way andrade put it when is Hami Mongia going to grow some cojones in order to step up in competition well one thing we do know it's not today nor the past five years. Nevertheless, congratulations to Munguia for knocking out Bellard in the third round. Now, the most shocking part about this fight is that the actual fight went three rounds. I mean, this fight should have went 30 seconds because as soon as Munguia really landed, the fight was over right there and then. In the third round, Munguia went to the body with the left hook, then came back up top with the left hook, and the fight was over at that moment since you could clearly see Bellard was not going to recover from that. Last but not least, you know it's bad. You know the ducking is extremely bad when the zone on commentators are criticizing a fighter on the hope list. That's where Munguia is at today along with Ramirez Canelo and Ryan Garcia. With the facts being laid out, drop your thoughts in the comment section below, subscribe below, and click on the notification bell to be continued on the next episode of Aki Aki Ak TV. Peace, and I'm on to the next one.